Ah, uh, honorary knight. Is something the matter? A uh, stranger with an eye patch. Hmm, let me think. Oh yeah, I remember seeing someone like that. A blonde stranger dressed in unusual garb. He was wandering all over Mondstadt at first, which I found rather suspicious. So I decided to keep an eye on him for a while. Uh, I lost him pretty quickly. Still, I didn't think that this was such a huge matter that we needed our outrider to pursue him by air. As long as Master Jean is here, there's nothing to fear from some suspicious, unusual looking person. That might be true, but if it were up to Jean, she'd take this way more seriously. <laughs> that is true. But on the other hand, knowing that Master Jean may overreact to the situation is all the more reason to not tell her, no? <sighs> Anyways, oh yeah, he was at Wagner Smithy for a while before I tried telling him. He might have said something to Wagner. You should go ask him. Maybe he has more news about our stranger. What? You need something? Here. I remember him. He showed up a few days ago asking to buy a bunch of forging materials. Can't say I've heard of any of the materials he mentioned, though. He then had a look at the weapons in my shop before leaving. I've heard that he can be found drinking at the Angel's Share. If the Knights of the Guild want to get hold of him, that's the only place to be. <laughs> the Angel's Share? Well, Master Diluc probably has his eye on that stranger, too, then. Anyway, let's go to the Angel's Share and have a look. What will it be? Grape juice or apple cider? Hey, Charles! Have you seen a blonde stranger who wears an eye patch around here by any chance? That I have. He comes here every night. Just a drink, though. Doesn't order anything else. He even sometimes mixes his own drinks after he orders them. I don't know anything else about him, but from his selections and mixes, I'd say that he's quite the connoisseur. And what's Master D. Luke's opinion? Why, I just gave it to you. Quite the connoisseur. Investigating everything as always. Guess that's D. Luke for you. If you're looking for that gentleman, he ordered some new bottle of wine in advance yesterday. So he should be here today, too. There's too many raucous patrons on the first floor, so if you want to wait, best to go to the second. Welcome, sir. The wine that you previously ordered is here. He's really here? Let's go downstairs and have a look. Wow! He's got no intention of paying us any mind, huh? A traveler, you say? Hm. Why are you traveling? <sighs> well, that's as good a reason as any. Sit down over there, then. So... Guess we've broken the ice. What a weird guy. Hmm, that little one beside you. Uh-huh, we're the best of friends! It's indeed a good thing to have someone accompany you on your travels. My name's Dainsliff. I suppose you have some business with me? Sure. Are you 
it was so cold just a moment before. Paimon's got a bad feeling about this. But I will require advance payment. 500 mora, and three answered questions. The 500 is a one-time fee, and we'll settle the questions in a moment. That's it. Well, now Paimon's got a really bad feeling. That kind of compensation can't be right. Ah, thank you. Now, as for my questions, I'd like you to answer them here and now. The answer to a question says nothing about right and wrong, only about differences in attitude. I only wish to know what your choices are. You need only answer. Question 1. The crisis Mondstadt faced was resolved by an alliance between yourself and that... Animo Archon who calls himself Venti. Who, in your view, was the key to ending that crisis? I know everything that I should. <laughs> well, answer the question. Is that your answer? Hmm, I see. Question number two. Rex Lapis, who has defended Liyue Harbor for millennia on end, used his Gnosis to lay down a contract to end all contracts, of which the stipulations are still unknown. Who do you think will defend Liyue Harbor in the future, now that they've lost their deity? So that's your answer? I see. Now for my final question. This world has people who gained visions, and those who did not. Which of the two do you think hold more importance in the eyes of the gods? So... This is your answer, then. I understand. As I thought, you really are similar to him. <laughs> I'll take that 500 mora. And now I also understand your views on this world. As we agreed, you may now commission me. That said, I only take commissions related to the Abyss Order. Like you, I am currently on a journey. You intend to find your sibling, while I wish to oppose the Abyss. Ugh. Those creatures that serve the Abyss are the fangs and claws by which the Order spreads chaos in this world. I have come to Mondstadt this time while on the trail of an Abyss Herald. An Abyss Herald? An even more twisted abyssal being, one that commands the abyss mages. Oh, that's right! We've just been fighting against the Fatui and Liyue, who are human too! We haven't encountered the non-human abyss order at all! There's some reason behind that, I'm afraid. It's possible that they may have been under orders to avoid your path. Oh, that does sound pretty dangerous. <gasps> Maybe they're looking for a better time to ambush us or something. Uh-huh. We're super duper strong. That manner. It's just like his. Well then, let's go see for ourselves, shall we? According to the leads I have on hand, the Abyss Order has re-infiltrated the Temple of the Falcon. Let's meet up at the temple. Perhaps your questions about the Abyss will be answered there. I need to learn to handle my news better. Or you can't give up.
This abandoned temple does bear some marks of the Abyss. The Falcon of the West. Though it can soar in the wind, it ultimately does naught but hover under the light of the gods. Hmm? Oh, it's nothing. Let's head inside. The scent of the Abyss is getting stronger. It's not far now. I what the Abyss look like. Do they look something like the Abyss Mages? Let's head further in first. If we do see that creature, that'll spare me the explanation either way. such a brute. No one 
that escapes my sight. and I'll be gentle. Oh, so sorry. Dodge this! Just a few abyss mages? Seems like that herald might have already left. The abyss. It is chaos, and it is also destruction. It is a morass of inconceivable madness that encroaches upon this world's very foundations. That is why even the Dragon of the East, a servant of a deity, was unable to resist its corrosive powers. And the creatures of the Abyss desire nothing less than the overthrow of a world ruled by the Archons. You seem to know a lot about the Abyss game. <laughs> well, we do have some history. I suppose that's as far as chit-chat goes. We should head to Wolvendom. Judging by the traces I'm following, their next appearance may be within the territory of that old wolf. Perhaps we may find our Abyss Herald there. <laughs>